Well, a concerning number of babies have tested positive for drug addiction at birth in Beltrami County. In 2010, Sanford Health of Bemidji recorded that 3% of all babies born at their facility had this problem. And the issue is one that remains relevant today. Jackson Bruner has more about what the First Steps to Healthy Babies program in Beltrami County is doing to help. There's not a mom or a dad on the planet that doesn't love their child. Um, chemical dependency, though, is it's a tricky thing because they're not always thinking three months from now. They're thinking today or they're thinking tomorrow. So sometimes our job is to put it in perspective for them. The First Steps to Healthy Babies program is focused on helping people who abuse substances in Beltrami County. The goal is to aid pregnant women with those problems in gaining control of them. There's a lot of fear in coming forth and saying that they are abusing chemicals and that they're pregnant. Um, this is meant to be a get them help, not get them in trouble kind of a program, so it's voluntary. Not to say that, that it is going to guarantee that they don't later on have a child protection issue that comes into play, but the hope is that we will avoid that. Drug use during pregnancy can lead to a condition called neonatal abstinence syndrome. In that situation, a child is going through withdrawal from the abused substance and needs around the clock help from a hospital's nursery staff. A lot of what we see is um, like neurological um, issues like tremors and jitteriness and um, a lot of these infants have a high-pitched um, high cry. The program's plan is a combined effort between Beltrami Human Services, Sanford Health of Bemidji, and the Red Lake Indian Reservation. The Human Services end looks to educate parents who have drug issues as it can, showing them pre-birth care options and addiction assessment surveys. I make sure that they get connected with the people that do those things. So if it's mental health that needs to be addressed, if it's chemical health, if it's homelessness, if it's... Um, you know, whatever it might be, their, their substance abuse, of course, is a large part of that uh, picture. And care doesn't stop when a child is born, as case managers like Cami Kelm have the option to help mothers for a full year after birth, providing guidance as they continue to recover from addiction. In Bemidji, Jackson Bruner, Lakeland News. First Steps program leaders have spent the last several weeks visiting schools in the area in order to teach teens about the importance of staying away from drugs. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.